we got transfers, ladies and gentlemen. What's the transfer rumor report? Uh, Manchester United could back out of the race to sign Harry Kane due to Tottenham's reluctance to sell him to another Premier League club or Real Madrid. They've also been linked with uh, with the English captain. Listen, Harry Kane is a great striker. He was linked to Manchester City, wanted to go to Manchester City, was not able to do it. Uh, he decided to stay at Tottenham and um, and renew there. I think I think it, it it was last season where he should have moved to a different club. He's a great striker, a great player. Really, I mean, you see that. Really, a, a complete player. For a player of his size, it's difficult to see somebody that can move, that can dribble, that can uh, make cuts. Look at that cut inside and then score with the left foot. You know, very, very strong, good uh, good going up on uh, aerial plays. You know, good. Uh, he just scores a lot of good goals, man. He's very talented. Definitely not somebody you'd see a 6'4", 6'3", guy do. He, what he does on the, on the pitch. So um, he could be a great addition to Real Madrid. You could move Jude Bellingham uh, to to the left side. I mean, if Mbappe gets there, he could play there also on the left side or right side. There's a lot of things that you could do with Jude and Kane. I'm not sure that Real Madrid would. Uh, I mean, I think Real Madrid is focusing on Mbappe right now. I mean, let's just keep it honest. Let's just keep it 100%. I think Harry Kane... Um, would join Real Madrid if it came to be, but you know they don't want to. Manchester United was linked to is has been linked to to Harry Kane, but apparently Tottenham do not want to sell him a, a player, which is crazy, you know. And uh, he it's also he's their top scorer. I mean, he's been a great addition, uh, Kane. He he has been so great to for the Spurs. And I don't think they've treated him with the great respect that he that he deserves, because they promised they promised him to sell him, and they were going to the Manchester City, and then they changed their their mind. And uh, hey, the dude wants to be in a bigger club, being able to fight for for different titles. Tottenham is not that club. Tottenham, the Spurs, are not a club that 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 is fighting for Champions League. That's fighting for, uh, for, 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 for the Premier League. Even you know, barely a team that could contend for the FA Cup or something like that. You know what I mean? They're not, um, they're not your, your your typical team that's gonna. I mean, he's a great player, but he can't do it alone. You know, uh, so I think he has a better chance though to go to um, to Manchester United. I think he has a bench, but apparently, from the information that we're gathering, Manchester United is not is not keen to do that. And uh, so, let's just keep moving real quick. The Red Devils are, however, continuing talks with Chelsea over a deal for Mason Mount. We already talked about that in the previous video in the channel, in the previous episode. Though they are not close to agreeing a transfer fee uh, yet, so we'll see what happens about that quickly. Arsenal are close to agreeing a deal with West Ham over uh, to sign Declan Rice, also a great player, good player that's playing uh, 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 great. And uh, with the Gunners set to pay a transfer fee that could surpass over 100 million euros if add-ons are met. So we'll see if Declan Rice can join Arsenal. Arsenal are trying to make a lot of moves, man. They're trying to make a lot of moves. They don't want to repeat. They thought they were close to the Premier League, but they weren't able to capitalize. They let it go, and they don't want to suffer that again. Barcelona winger Ansu Fati refusing to join Wolves as part of a swap deal for midfielder Ruben Neves. He does not want to join the Wolves. Uh, Barcelona are surprisingly trying to take him off the books, man. Uh, somebody that, that they put over, like, I believe, a high, high transfer fee. And, uh, I mean, he's been getting hurt over and over, though. That That's kind of, that's kind of the deal, you know. He's been getting hurt, and... Uh, it is what it is. Uh, Liverpool Liverpool want Levi Colwell, but understand that it would be difficult to pry him away from Chelsea. Uh, so that's another little nugget that's out there. Manchester City remain interested in center back Josco Vardio, uh, but Leipzig will command a fee uh, north 
of 75 million for the Croatian, according to Talksport. So, I mean, if you wanted, to, I don't know if he's worth 75 million, man. He's he's he, I don't I don't think he's worth that that much money. 